beautiful old man. What a lovely head. India is filled with old men, Mam Sahib. But not like the one in the yellow turban. He's like a head of John the Baptist. The Mam Sahib refers to the storyteller. Are these silent monsters at peace with us? It is but a truce they keep with man. But I, who have seen their tusks stained red with blood, I could tell you a tale of the silent ones. For a few coppers? Hey. Yeah, for a bowl of rice. What would you do with my image, Mem Sahib? I would keep it for a memory of India. Verily, you would have all India in your picture. Nay, you would have the Book of the Jungle to read in my eyes. In the beginning, you must think of nothing but silence. A silence so vast that the ear can hear it. Great trees, like the pillars of the temple, with ferns like green carpets underneath. While above, under the dome of heaven, will live the winged ones. The wind moves restlessly whistling across the roof of the world. These are the eaters of grass in a world of torn flesh. Early, the little fawns must learn the lesson. Feet that make no noise, eyes that see in the dark. Ears that hear the leopard leaving his lair. For the leopard lives by the law of claw and horn and fang. He will kill for hunger and eat thereof, but he will never kill for killing's sake. A law which all men break, but the jungle folk obey. of the jungle, the tribe of Hathi, the silent ones. They go their way, eaters of grass in a world of carnage. hunters of the jungle, and like huntsmen, they stick to their clan with a strict regard for hunting calls and tribal law. Free companions of the woods, they may fight and quarrel among themselves until the strongest of them wins the leadership of the man. Jungle folks say the wisest among them is the tribe of Blue, the bear. <laughs> he is a teacher of the jungle law. Yet there is one who knows no law. The barrel-bodied mugger, the crocodile. With his chin in his shallows and lust in his cold heart hoping to drag down to the depths all who wander along his riverbank. And in the legends of the jungle, there is a black prince, shrewdest of the lords of claw, horn, and fang, as bold as a buffalo, as reckless as a wounded elephant. 
voice as soft as wild honey dripping from a tree, unbridled, unmastered, unafraid. Bagheera, the Black Panther. And now, behold the villain of my tale, the killer, the man-eater, the assassin who first brought murder to the jungle clans, Shere Khan. The tiger. <laughs> it is said that in his first kill, when he was keen to some poor Abel of the glades, when he ran from the scene of his crime, the trees and creepers whipped him with their branches and striped his yellow hide with the mark of Cain. This evil lord must have his dish lickers, his bullies for attendance. Tabaki the jackal. And the hyena. Hungry for the scraps of the murderous master's feast. But my tale is not alone of outcasts and heroes. I will tell you also of the rock snake, Ka. The wise one. The oracle who taught Mother Eve the speech men use for trickery and sin. What is the book of life itself but man's war with nature? The struggle between village and jungle. Under the mantle of wild creepers and great trees, many a ruined city lies forgotten in the pages of time. Where a thousand war chariots proclaim the might of a great king before whom all men bowed their heads. Nothing remains but a trellis for wild figs to sun upon. And what of the great Maharaja, the loser in this battle? He has left many such a palace to his cousins, the monkey folk. The bandalogs, the outcasts of the jungle. First, you must picture me as I was, my lords. Valdeo, the mighty hunter. It was a long time ago, and very far away. On a summer's evening in the Sioni Hills. Ajo! Ajo! Again, some palaver. It's Baldeo, Master. That fool would make speeches the whole day. Come, Durga. Let's listen to him. Ajo! Cannot build your houses just anywhere. We have to plan out our village. Someday there will be a mighty city here. Huh? A mighty city with marble houses. The temple shall be there facing the marketplace. That's where I wanted the bean patch. No, that's for the marketplace, as Boldeo says. And uh, the barber shop will face the temple. I shall find some place for the bean patches anyway, outside your mighty city. Go, Durga. Take the child and the old man to the cart. Natu. Come, Grandfather. Did you hear that? We're going to have a marketplace and a temple and a mighty city. Aye, we'll have all that if we can beat the jungle. But have you in your hundred years seen man win a war with nature? Sit here, Grandfather. There, not too. Oh. Go back to your work. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, don't worry, Miss Sewer. The child couldn't go far. I'll look for him right away. Durga, you search in there. Not to! Not to! Let us all go and look for the child. All men, bring your spears. Ali, sing! Abdullah, torches! Follow me. Natu! 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 Poor little baby. Poor little Natu. And that poor mother. Poor mother? Is it every woman who can have a wolf nurse her baby for her? Do you believe that, Subadar? Oh, yes, Ma'am Sahib. And His Excellency, your father, has many records of wolf children from the Indian hills. It is true. True? In the beginning, was it not written that the she-wolves loved the children of man? Were not the wolves the foster parents of many a child in India? Little, naked and bold, the man's cub entered the wolf's cave. Aye. He felt just as much at home with the cubs as at his mother's side. sleep among his brothers of the jungle. Akela, the father wolf, and Raksha, the mother wolf, knew that Shere Khan is prowling outside looking for the man cub. So they took him into their family. grew up with the cubs. They called him Mowgli, the little frog. Father Wolf taught him his business until every rustle in the grass meant just as much to him as to his brothers, the wolf cubs. All the lords of the jungle became his friends. He had only one enemy, Shere Khan, the tiger. Did Mowgli live to hunt Shere Khan? Did he live? Oh, but had I known then what I know now. Twelve years had passed. Shere Khan was on the trail of the wolf boy.
seen fire before. He's from the jungle. Yes, he's yes. a wild boy. We must be kind to him. Release him. Release him. Are you mad? This is a thing of the jungle. Let me look. Let me look. Look at the scars on his arms and legs. Those points on his bones. He has run on all fours with wolf cubs. Poor child. This boy has been reared in the jungle. He has the evil eye. Oh, I begin to think he has. Moonshine. I think this boy is Masua's little baby, which was stolen that day we built the wall. Could this boy be yours, Masua? No, he's not mine. But he's a handsome boy. Eyes like red fire. Any woman would like to have a son like him. But my Natu is soft and plump. Mistress, how could he be plump, running naked in the woods? I warn you all, he has the evil eye. No, Bodeo, he is some poor lost lad, though not my own. But I am a lonely woman, and if you would let me, I will shelter him for some other woman who has lost her son. He is a wolf. Let one in, and all will follow. He will bring down the jungle upon us. Oh. Oh. What the jungle has taken, the jungle has restored, Bodeo. Aye. Take this boy into thy house, my sister. And out of your little hoard of money, forget not to honor me, for I have saved his life on this day. Release him! Wait! Are you going to turn this devil loose before I can protect you? A gun. Bordeaux. Don't. A gun! Bordeaux. Now we'll release him. Ah! <laughs> no. No. Boy. Boy. Will you come with me? Down upon our heads, even before the temple, we have called the curse of the beast. No more shall we prosper. The wild pig will trample down our vines. The tiger will stalk our streets. We have opened our doors to the devil. Don't look upon evil. Mahara, get home to bed. At least I can keep my own daughter from harm. Get back, Kuta. 
Is there any way to treat one who has come to live with us? Remember the day I gave the first little shoes to my nut? Feet have never worn shoes. No, you are not my son. But you look very much like my son, not to. Not to called me mother. You were like a little frog to them, the beasts of the jungle. <laughs> and so you are Mowgli to me. Come. Come on. For months and months after that night, Mowgli was busy learning the ways, language, and customs of men. Like a little panther. I thought someone had found the hiding place. Hiding place? Mm -hmm. What is this? Money. What is it for? What is money for? To protect us from hunger and cold. It lives in a hole like a cobra? <laughs> no. If we need a bag of rice, I give these to the merchant in the square. He gives us the rice. <laughs> what a fool that merchant must be. <laughs> no. Will the men pack give us anything for this? Yes. Will you give me a, a tooth? Tooth? You have all your teeth? No, a, a sharp tooth. Oh, a knife? Yes, a knife tooth, like a tiger's knife. What need have you for a knife? To sink it in the throat of my enemy. Your enemy? Oh, you talk about Akela, the father wolf, and Rakshaw, the mother wolf, and how much better it is in the jungle with all your friends. Now, who could be your enemy? Shere Khan. A tiger. Tell Boldeo to sell you a knife. And give him the money. I shall have a tooth. I shall have a tooth.
father says I mustn't speak to you. What happened to him? My father shot him. We missed you six moons ago. He was Baloo's cousin. He had no man for an enemy. But my father kills every bear he sees. Why? Because he is a great hunter. He kills them even when he's not hungry? Hungry? We don't eat bears. Then why did he bring him here? To show how brave he is. And my father was very brave to kill that tiger. That old tiger. He lived on lizards and rats. He was too old to hunt rabbits. He must have died in his sleep. I see. You could kill the bear and the tiger with one shot. I killed Baloo's cousin? I've gone fishing with him. Fishing with a bear? How can a bear bait a fish hook? He looks in the river, he sees a fish he wants, then, whoop, knocks it out. Didn't I tell you not to speak with this thing? I told Miss Sua to keep you away from this house. Miss Sua sent me here to talk to you. She sent me to get a tooth. A tooth? Yes. This is the tooth I want. Put that knife down before I send a shot through you. And then you would put my head on the wall, like the old Khan there. But I would spring as I die and give this tooth back to you. Oh, no. You're not in the jungle, boy. No. No, oh, I'm not in the jungle, Baldio. I'm with the man pack, but I'm not a man. What are you, boy? I was until now a cub, but now I have my tooth. I can run with the jungle as I please. I'm a wolf. If you had a knife, would you go back to the jungle? The knife is yours, for two annas. So I give me three. One, two, three. There. Three is more than two. Yes, more than two. Now get out of my house. See, Shere Khan? It is for you. Deep in your okay. throat. Won't you be afraid to go back to the jungle? Afraid of the jungle? Why? I'm of the wolf pack. They are my friends. Then why did you buy the knife? For Shere Khan, the tiger. This is for him. He drove me out of the jungle. He went away far off. But he swore he would lay my bones in the river when he returned. Mm. I also made a little promise. I have told the wolves I would kill him. You can speak their tongue? You can speak to animals? Can you talk to Rama, the great herd bull? Rama is a dumb slave. He has been with the man pack so long, he cannot talk to anyone. Can you speak to him? <laughs> What did he say? Don't you know what the monkey people always say? We, the monkey people, are the greatest folk in all the jungle. We know this is true, because we always say it is true. Mowgli, will you let me hear you talk to the wolves? Yes. Tonight, when the moon rises,
पूजन हुआ जाए विंड एंड ट्री जंगल पेपर गो विद दी यू हैव बीन गिवन द पेपर ऑफ द जंगल Now, see, I have a tooth as sharp as a tiger's tooth. <coughs> he said Shere Khan is far away, but I had better take care and hide when he comes back here. Hathi, will you warn me when he comes back to our jungle? <coughs> Thank you, brothers. Then we shall see whose bones will be laid in the river. Hold on. Hi. are sharp and strong but not as good as mine look oh. who is man that i should care for his ways brown digger he travel i am mogli of the jungle back in the night now that i have my tooth who shall stay me when i strike mogli come back i'm afraid than your father who killed everything until the jungle killed them why did they go away why did i go away because i was a man cop afraid of a tiger and the jungle knew i was afraid and cast me out this was the king's palace king what is a king oh mogli you know so much and yet you know so little this was a great wall city a city with hundreds of elephants and thousands of horses and thousands and thousands of men and it all belonged to a great king 
And where is this great king now? And where is this great king now? Like the stuff I gave a layer for my tooth. The stuff that passes from hand to hand. It never grows warmer. Only this is yellow. And that was brown. Let's get back to the light. These pebbles are no good to eat. There is nothing here. Nothing. We be a one blood, you and I. She's only a little cup from the man pack. She means thee no harm. Go out down with the knife and the snake's tongue. Mowgli, they call me. I am of the jungle. The wolves are my people. Father Cobras, who art thou? I am the warden of the king's treasure. The great king built a stone above me that I might teach death to those who come to steal. Three times the stone has been lifted by thieves. Look at thy feet. The thieves are still here. But I am no thief. Mala, be still. Oh, no, boy. Let her run to and fro a while. Let her make some sport. The others did so until I touched them. Then they whimpered a while. Sighed and was still. Kill him, Mowgli. Kill him? Don't be afraid. Look, our father of cobras is so old he has outlived his poison. There's been too much talk of killing. Come, Mahala. We'll go now. Keep that silly treasure. I'll take this. I can use it to proud Rama with. Look at the ruby, Mowgli. You could buy hundreds of villages with it. Aye, boy. Thousands of villages. Take it with thee. But see that it does not kill thee at last. Kill me? This stone? Yes. Ruby holds more death 
and all my tribe. It will kill and kill and kill for killing's sake. My strength is dried up, but this stone will do my work. It is dead, it is dead, it is dead. But take the ruby if thou wilt. Nay, Father Cobras, I believe thee. We shall go as we came. Aye, you'd be wise to take no death with thee. May I take just this one piece, Mowgli? Keep it, if you like. Get up, lazy bones. I dreamed I was a princess in the city of the great Maharaja. Get up. There's no fire in the grate, and there is no rice here. But it was not a dream. I saw the great king's city. Get on with you. Enough of this talk. Dream? This is no dream. Maybe I am dreaming. This is pure gold. Who gave this to you, my darling child? The white cobra. Cobra? Yes. I did not want the diamonds. Diamonds? Nor the big ruby. Big ruby? This big. This big. Where? What nonsense is this? What is this room, this ruby? When did you go there? Whose gold is this, Mahala? The great king's gold. In the treasure chamber of the king's palace. I tell you, Father, Mowgli said I might keep just this one. Mowgli? You have been in the jungle. Last night, Mowgli took me there. But, Father, you will not hurt him. I would not harm him. Hair of his head. But you must never let anyone know about this. Not a living soul, do you hear? Yes, Father. Good morning, Boleo. Good morning. I, I, I can't take you now, Boleo. It'll be at least another hour. Barbara, there, there, there is no river between us. Oh, oh, oh my, 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 my poor leg. Uh, 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 this lumbago is killing me. I can't go around with half my beard cut. Oh, this lumbago is terrible. I, I, I can hardly bend my knee. What makes you tremble like wash upon a lion? Now, no, you, you keep out of this, Bulldog. If I cut him, he, he, he doesn't have to pay. You want to cut me? No, no. Now, listen here, Barbara. I'm not a man to be shown like a sheep in the midst of a block. Barbara, I've won. Barbara, hmm? move your left foot. I said the left foot. Oh, oh, the le, 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 left. Uh, the, his foot. Mm. Excuse me, Boldeo. You are standing on my money. Your money? I saw it first. I... It's mine. There's no need to quarrel. There's enough for all. Where? Where? There's a lost city. In the jungle. Y you have found a treasure. Where? Shh. Do you want to tell the whole village? Not a word now.
Avengers coming. She's yellow hide. Mowgli! Mowgli! What is your son, Monsieur? Where did he go? Stop him. He has gone after the tiger. Oh, they're bragging of a child. Don't be impatient, Bulldale. He'll be back. I suppose the tiger should kill him. Oh, what a tragic calamity. No, no. We must save him. We must bring him back. How kind you all are to comfort me this way. He really is a sweet boy. I knew you would come to love him. Love him? I wish I had a boy like him. Now, don't worry. If he's not back in a short time, I'll track him to the ends of the earth. <laughs> J. 
jackal told me so uh, before he passed on. Apache? Yes, indeed. Here he is. How may I slay his master, Ka? He'd kill you with one blow. Let us go upstream. Hold on, little brother. Shere Khan is nothing but a big cat. And all cats fear the water. But Shere Khan will not follow me into the river. Since you're a man, use your cunning. And if I made him angry, Ka, will he follow me into the river? If he will not catch you first. <laughs> Thank you, worst of all. Go on. I'll wait for you here. Wish me good hunting, a wise, strong, and most beautiful car. Good hunting. Shere Khan, did I wake you up? You hunter of worms, you striped cattle thief, don't sneak away. Coward, you mangy yellow dog, come back. Can't you jump? Are you too old, you frog eater, fish killer? <laughs> Get your hide today. No, no, I won't come down. You come up to me. Get this. And this. Shere Khan, catch me!
something dangerous. Yes. Maybe the tiger is waiting for us in this tall grass. All right. Stay here. the boy and tears the secret from him and, and then says he didn't find him. You're right. We cannot trust him. Uh, you go first and I'll protect your rear. You go first and I'll protect your rear. Go on. By the bull that bought me, I made a promise. A little promise. Only thy coat is lacking before I keep my word. Come, Shere Khan, lend me your coat. You won't need it anymore. You don't need to shoot Baldeo. I have killed him. Look at him. This is the end of a very old war. <laughs> you have killed him. You found him there. I killed him with my tooth. He is mine. Who are you to tell me what is yours? Get up, boy. You took my daughter to the jungle last night. You took her to a lost city. Come on. Take me to the treasure chamber. I will not take you, Baldeo. The lost city is a city of death. The treasure is death. I will never take you there. Come on, jungle brat. Come on, or I'll shoot you. Go ahead and shoot. You scum of the wolf cave. I, I hope he didn't shoot the boy. No. No. That's a sign for us. Back to a man and, and spare my life. Spare my life, Mugly. up and go away, my lord. Get up. Go, tell Masua that Mowgli has avenged her men. He has killed Shere Khan and will bring home his yellow hide. Maharaj. Look. Great king. <laughs> go on. Maharaja. Maharaja. Great. Tell me the secret, too. Tell me, too. They say there's enough for three. Great. Great. Three old vultures? Go back to your village. Yes, my lord. <laughs> Maharaja. My king. Where, where is the Come back to your village. Maharaja. Great <laughs> No? Did he tell you the secret? Come on, where's the treasure? D don't try to cheat us. The boy told you where to go. Boy, indeed. Didn't I tell you the first time I saw him? He was a witch. I saw him with my own eyes change himself into a black panther. <laughs> Come on, Bulldale. No tricks now. If you try to cheat us, we'll change you into something worse. But I swear to you. 
Get on, Bakira. Stop their quarrel. <laughs> the boy's turned himself into a black panther before my eyes. He is a witch, I tell you. I must warn the village. Bakira. I still think you're lying. And I'll soon find out. <laughs> So, get up, Blanchard, spill the fire! Remember, he must have a chance to confess. Yes, the three of us will deal with him alone. We'll deal with him, of course. find the treasure. We'll burn him, but not now. The boy will lead us to the lost city first. Not you, my little son. Why won't you tell them the secret? Never will I take them into the jungle. But they will set you free. Free to live with me. Live with you? I have a jungle mother, too. And these two things fight together in me, like the snakes fight together in the spring. I was a wolf. The jungle cast me out. I'm a man. The man pack cast me out. But you have killed Shere Khan. You can go back to the jungle. I, you can be lord of the jungle. No. I have nowhere to go. The red flower. The fire. Oh, no. But it does not matter. The jungle will know from Bakira that I have killed Shere Khan. No. The jungle will know from you, Mowgli. See? Here is your tooth. Mother. Are you all 
so too dumb to see it? Of course. He'll escape and then we'll follow him to the treasure. That's right. You two go to the edge of the jungle. Wait there. And mark his trail. Go. Your time is up. Who freedom get her? No. Wait, wait! Masuwa is no witch! But Baldeo is a bat! Tie both of them until I return. by this tree. He never suspected we'll let him escape. Don't say that. See, there is his trail. They will be here soon. Quiet, you grinning black shadow. Quiet, Grey Brother. This is not our kill. I'm 
Herman. I want that ruby. It's, it's, it's mine. Let's you go. miserable barber. It belongs to my robe. It belongs to me, understand? No. It's we mine. We lost our reason. Are we children? Isn't there enough for three, three hundred, three thousand? We'll be the most powerful men in all India. Here, I can buy thousands of rubies like this with my share. <laughs> well, there. You are wise and good. You saved my life. You killed the cobra. You are my friend. Then stop quarreling. Load yourselves up. We have to get out before nightfall. Thieves. 
vultures. Get out of the jungle. Get out. Did, did I hear what I heard? The panther spoke with the tongue of the boy. Yes. The boy spoke with the tongue of the panther. This place is bewitched. Go, go, go! Heading back to the lost city. I wanted to look at the road. 
he, he tried to kill me. I had to do it, Boleo. I had to do it. Naturally. You, you must bear witness. You must bear witness, Boleo. I had to kill me, Buleo. You must bear witness. I had to kill him. I had to kill him, Buleo. I hear someone call. <laughs> now, Gray Brother, there is only one. Bagheera! Gray Brother, chase him out of the jungle. Sing him home.
monster. Change into any beast you will. Wolf, panther, any beast you will. I'm not afraid of you. Change. Change! <laughs> the village of the man pack that cast me out. They are idle, senseless, and cruel. They do not kill the weaker for food, but for sport. When they are full fed, they would throw their own breed into the red plow. This I have seen. It is not well that the man pack should live here anymore. <coughs> <coughs> Kill them? Why? What good are the white bones to me? I shall let the jungle in upon them and give the village back to the wild gold vine. They will burn us both. Why did you fight them, Durga? Why did you defend me? It was I who brought him into the world. He is my son. Aye, mistress. You could have saved yourself, Dirk. No, mistress. If you must leave the world tonight, it is written that I shall go with you. Mateo is here! Look! Mateo! Oh, no. <laughs> Where is the pundit? Where is the barber? Dead. Both dead. Killed by the wolf boy. But I know how to deal with him. I'll burn him! Burn him all! I'll burn him! will take them. But they were frightened, Mowgli. Lead them, Mahala, to the little island in the middle of the stream. 
we saw the elephants, Mowgli? Yes, the fire can't catch you there. Hurry, the wind is shifting. But you, my son, come with us. Not while one little cub is in danger. I'm of the jungle. Their lair is my lair. Their trail is my trail. Their fight is my fight. <laughs> Godling of the woods. So I didn't have my revenge after all. I became no Maharaja of a mighty city. Even the little 
village burned to the ground. In my struggle with the jungle, as you see, my lords, I was beaten. And then? What happened then? What became of Mowgli and your daughter? And how did you escape from the fire? Batman Sahib is another story. Yeah.